everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to Vlogtober. Now, it's only been a few minutes since the part one of this vlog. If you haven't seen that, I'll link it above. Go and watch that first so this one makes more sense. With that being said, I am just going to start on dinner. It is 25 to 5, so it's a bit late to get dinner started, but we've had good snacks and all that jazz. Let me show you how bad the weather is. Look at that. It's full on miserable. So I'm making my easy healthy roast. I do have a recipe of this on my channel so I'll put a link for it above but basically there's olive oil, there's leeks, there's carrots under there you can't see because of the potatoes, there's potatoes and chicken breast and then it's been cooking for about half an hour and now I'm going to add some stock to it. and it's going to go back in for about an hour and a half. I have been meaning to swap out these. Basically, I bought these really cheaply. There's nothing wrong with them. I think I got them in Sainsbury's, but the reason why I bought them was because when we got our dishwasher, we started washing these, which are our nice set in the dishwasher, and it kind of started wrecking them, so we stopped using them. So now that we no longer have a dishwasher and we're not going to get one, I'm going to donate these and start using these again. These are by, let me see if I can show you. Oh, is it going to focus? Vista Alegre, which is a Portuguese really good brand. Um, yeah, and they are really cool the way they look. My mum made this set for me. I've got not just these but then I've got the fish set as well as well as dessert set I also have these little forks they're not part of this set but I'm gonna start using them so let's swap it all out So there's the set. The only thing is, these little spoons, I've only got four and there should be six. And teaspoons is something that we use a lot, so I'm going to keep part of the other set. Hmm. Alex is watching Batman. So here's my drawer in the, it's in the dining room area. As you can see, I've got the fish and the knives and then the dessert spoons and stuff and then I have as well oh sorry loads of different these are like a tapper set by Port Marion really love those let me show you so here's the tapper set this is so sweet so cute I have some little cute butter knives this is my stirrer so when I make pims I stir it with this. It's made of crystal, actually. Crystal? This is, babe. Cri crystal. Uh, 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 don't touch it. But 
Alex. No, no, no. Let go, please. Just got some serving. This is a cake spoon. Some little serving spoons. I've got more in there. Some cheese knives. And then that is a carving set as well. This is a really good brand. I always get these in TK Maxx. I've got a couple sets of napkin rings. I've got these bejeweled ones and then like some little rope ones some of you asked me about my mugs my collection has gone down loads and i really if you follow me on instagram i mentioned it i really want to just get white mugs but all different textures so i picked this one up for ticket from tk max it's actually from royal dalton it's 2.99 which is a bargain i also have these white ones from ikea these are so what is that? Oh, I think I need to wash that. These are so cute. And then I do, I've always loved this one. It's very me. If there was a mug that defined my style, this is it. I picked this up in TK Maxx. Here's the brand as well. Um, and then this mug I got when I moved to England, right? It was really cheap. I think it was like a pound. And I've never got rid of it because it was the very first thing I bought when I got to England. So it's over 20 years old. This is Paul's mug. I bought him this. It's from, there you go. Then I've got this one here. That is by Susie Watson Designs. And actually the main reason why I've kept that mug for so long it's because it was really expensive it was like 15 pounds and but it's actually really awkward it doesn't fit in my coffee machine but anyway I've kept it I also love this one look how cute that is that is by this brand atomic soda I picked this up in a shop called um, vinegar hill love that and then finally this one that I also love, here it is, let me see, designed by Scandinavian team, QDO, this is actually, oh there it is, yeah it says the same, this is actually, um, there's no heat so you put a hot drink in it and, oh why is it not focusing, there we go, and it feels cool on the outside. Then I also have these teacups. Sorry, the lighting is rubbish in here. But I also have these teacups. They are from Jamie Oliver at home. So when he used to have like a, a home range that you could go to like a Tupperware party type of thing. And I, I have had these for many years and I just love them. Look at that lip. I think so classy and gorgeous. But yeah, I'm really feeling the white guys white mugs different patterns you know like different textures but all in white that's what I'm aiming at so I'm keeping an eye out for different mugs as I see them so yeah here's dinner looks delicious Ritz mommy I'm gonna see how hot you are okay What happened? Then Chase, I saw I I I touched it and then it made me spin around and then before you touch it again. And okay, it so these are all finished. These are the ones that are in use, and these are the other ones that I made. Loads of the jelly and the 
quince paste. There we go. The kitchen is all tidied up. How cute is that? That is from Wilco's and it's actually a Christmas ornament, but I think it could be out. Oh, and that is it for this video, you guys. Another one done for you. I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you tomorrow for more Vlogtober. Bye for now.